So I recently did a clip about a guy came home and his dad was there alone with his wifey for lifey, right? And she was frying chicken, wearing booty shorts and all that. And his dad was just chilling, had his feet kicked up, laid back, drinking on a beer. And this brings up the conversation of family members being around your significant other and what's appropriate and what's not appropriate. In this case, this one is something that has been going on for quite some time and it's something that both men and women deal with when it comes to this. So we got a aunt and a niece and a husband involved in this situation. So without further ado, let's get into this clip. Let's go guys. No ma'am, no ma'am. Go ahead and get my house because you're not gonna keep coming around me and my husband like dressed like this. What are you looking your like man is a, this because your man got issues. No, no ma'am, no ma'am, niece, niece. And you older than You dressing in broad day like get your you house. Just wish you, you can't come back over here no more you dressed like that. You, could look you need like to be this. modest. You walk you around looking like a Why? 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 You should be thinking about your moral value. You going to the club or what? 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 You going to the club or a little better. You wish she you would raise you a little better. Me. I you look like a big walker. You ain't gonna have no walker. husband. Baby, billionaires you gonna have your husband can't even like that. Me. But you gonna be around my dad. That. That's what you ain't gonna be. Like so me. you just gonna walk down the street, can honey. Can walk down, down the street. Walk down, down the street. Go on, baby. He gonna put on your feet. talking to you about the same thing. Why I keep talking to you about the same thing? Just gonna keep on down the road, honey, because that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. You talking all that? Come on, tell me where you was going. Coming to my house why looking at me like that. Why is that your business? Where what you I going coming to my house looking like that? We huh? both for those. Why you, why, where you bra at? Where you bra at? You proud, that's the problem. They hanging around to you. Yes, I'm talking to you. What are you looking crazy like that for? Go you got on. me walking the Go wrong on. way. My car over here. You don't even you know where you're dressed. Like, your car is down. Because like you so pressed about a man who want a young girl. You should be you thinking so about You so pressed yourself. trying to get my man, but you can't get your own. You First supposed to baby, respect me. I, I have 40 auntie. men. I'm my auntie. You're supposed to respect me. And what you're my respect? auntie. You should care about me. You but should I love me. Telling you you shouldn't be feeling my You shouldn't feel no type of way about how I dress. You should you should be thinking about your man and the youngest man. You should be thinking about it. look like you're trying to take my children. You want to your family about it. You want to argue about a man. Because I keep telling you the same shit. You want to your family. So, no, no, don't be crying now. Don't be crying now. What you crying for? Yes, I can. I used to watch for you. And this is what you come to my house doing? This is what you come to my house doing? Whatever. Give me my thing I did for you and your mother wasn't there. I take it back. Give me all my money back since you want my husband so well, bad. If you feel since like you, you want my husband so bad, give back everything that I did Whatever, for you. Girl, I, I don't want your husband. Your husband, your husband you. want me. See, yeah. from what so you my, did for me. You think you look good. You think you look good. You think you're doing for me after you took care of me. Because you act like you ain't got no dog training. I just and want y'all to real. see this. That's what I yes, want y'all to see. Thing. That's what I want you to see. So take your come back over here looking like no period. <laughs> go on, on. You gotta go. Leave. Leave. Bye. Bye. Don't put out with that. You're gonna do that. Find somebody else house to do it in. Hey yo, so that skit right there was skitting, wasn't it? I mean, I guess he caught them. Jerry's a skit. Filming the skit and was like, "Y'all doing all right? You going through things?" But looked like she already had her ride out there waiting on her. She hopped in the passenger side and skated. But uh, what was she saying? The niece, she was just like, "You mad fat?" Did, did she say something like that at the end? That's what I thought she said. But got the little girl backpack, the little pink backpack. Got the little dress on. A little something, a little slimmings. But uh, baby, you said you've told her a few times, right? You told her don't dress like that around the house. These are things that as a man, when you have family members over there, especially if she said she used to babysit her as a niece, but she's coming around dressing like this. Human nature is human nature. A man is going to look a lot of times but he's gonna look and especially if you're around the house and she's putting on like this and it's not it's trying to show off up in the man's face this is where there are issues this is where families have issues and that, that brings up i was just thinking about that movie soul food y'all remember that movie where buddy ended up smashing what was she the cousin or whatever over his wife and somebody posed the question who would you choose would you choose the wife or the cousin in this situation 
the cousin who was a dancer. I think she was a dancer or a singer, whatever she was. I think she was a dancer. But Buddy ended up clapping those cheeks in the movie. She was younger, if you will, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, he just got tired of hearing the wifey. And you have a woman coming around dressing like this in front of a man. And I've had so many women when that last video I did about it, I can dress how I want to dress and it's my house, it's my place. I get it, it's your place, but if there's men, men are wired differently. Some men will try you. Most men, I'm not saying there aren't men with morals, principles, and values that won't do that because there are. But there are a lot of sleaze balls out there that will try you. Oh. What, what we got going on here, huh? Camera on my face. What, what we got? Right? What we got going on here, huh? What, what, what y'all? Hey, don't fucking junior me, man. Don't fucking junior me, man. It's your third time this week popping up in my motherfucking house without letting me know you gonna pop up, huh? You fucking eat chicken, and you got these little ass shorts on. What's wrong with y'all, man? What the hell y'all got going on? You got your legs wide open. Drinking is no ain't tripping. You think I'm stupid or something? Regardless if you're a family member or what I mean by that is you got dudes doing sick stuff. But in this case, it appears that they're not blood related, if you will, as far as her husband. But this is stuff that just goes on and women will make excuses. Some will take this aunt side. Some will take her side. I I'm much younger. I look better. Right. I can take your husband. I can have your man. You even heard her say. I can have 40 men. I don't want your man. Baby, you need a place to stay. If you can have 40 men and what you said, billionaires. If you're dealing with billionaires, why are you over at your auntie house? Why are you constantly at your auntie house around the husband? Maybe he's sliding you a few dollars on the side and that's what it is. You talking about this billionaire stuff, but you getting a few dollars from him on the side to come by. And it happens all the time. It happens all the time. It's familiar. It's proximity. And what's the purpose of coming back there other than you needing a place to stay? But like I said already, if you're dealing with billionaires and all this stuff, baby, if you can have 40 men, as she says, what are we doing here? What are we really doing here? Have you guys dealt with something like this before? Have you guys had to deal with this foolishness? Comment below. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit me up on Linktree to book a one-on-one -on -one with yours truly. Purchase all my books, merch, and t-shirts. It helps to support the channel. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. With that being said, much blessings. Stick around for the next video that's going to pop up on the screen below. That's where I'm going to see you guys at. This is your favorite everything. Listen, this is wisdom. I'm out of here. Peace. Uh, yeah. 50 cents. 50. Part two. Yeah. Can't forget Tony. 50. UK.